Hey friends, Doug Addison here. It's March 7th, 2019. And um, I just did my Spirit Connection webcast last night. I do it the first Wednesday of every month, but boy, there was a warfare against this prophetic word. And my, my live stream went down. So, so sorry if you showed up for it or you were looking for it. I uh, wasn't able to, to live stream it, but uh, my team was praying and I just went ahead and recorded it. And we now have it up on my uh, website, DougEdison.com. So powerful. The prophetic word I released and, and the encounter that I had uh, was um, basically uh, about the a global revival angel that's being released right now. And God's doing something so powerful, so radical. You've got to get a hold of this. You've got to hear uh, this, uh, you know, as I released it, uh, the Lord showed up even. And I I released uh, uh, my prophetic word the first, uh, uh, actually, it's the first Wednesday of every month. I always do the word for, for March or for the month, and that's March, which basically is the, um, the that the, we're moving into a season right now of dreams and visions. We're, tie, we're in this time where you're going to see uh, the interaction with dreams increase, the understanding of dreams increase. You're going to see angels come into your dreams. So watch for this to start to happen. Also, there's so many encounters right now that I'm having encounters all the time. So I want to just mention now before I get going to the spirit is that I'm going to do a special training in March, March 16th. And it's called God Encounters, Breaking Down Walls and Bringing Freedom. And it's happening March 16th, 10 a.m. You'll just go to DougAdison.com forward slash God Encounters or click on my website. You'll see it there. I do it. I try to do a training every month, not all every month, but sometimes I do. I take everything deeper uh, that the Lord's speaking to me. So check that out. It's going to be really exciting. So we are in this season of dreams and visions right now. And uh, also, the Lord gave me this word called the weight of waiting. And many people are feeling like a weight from heaven. I don't know if you are or not, but I sure am. And it's like this weight has been on you. Feel tired maybe, or, or maybe some people even feel weary because you've been battling so long. But I tell you, March is a turning point. I saw people entering into the Lord's rest. I saw the... Uh, what was intended for evil is now being shifted into good. And it's very interesting what's going on right now. And in the prophetic word, which, by the way, will be out tomorrow, March, uh, Friday, March 8th. And uh, it's it's about, uh, you know, I have it on my website and everything. But also in that and in my webcast, I mean, uh, uh, yeah, my Spirit Connection webcast, I talk about the books of Satan opening. I saw the books of the enemy, the plans of the enemy being revealed and open. Now we know that some people say, where's that in the Bible? Well, we know that Satan counterfeits, you know, uh, and you'll see uh, the prophetic gift is opposite of the psychic gift. And so you, Satan can't create, he just counterfeits. So we do know that we all have a book of life and the book of life is in Psalm 139, 17 or 16. And we know that there's the Lamb's book of life. So uh, actually, there's plans of the enemy against you that are being revealed this month. In fact, right now, there's stuff going on. This is not supposed to scare you. Some people are like, oh, no, you know, freaking out. I don't want to know. This, I tell you, you want to know this stuff because this will show you how to pray. And it's God's, in other words, God's given you revelation into why you've been sick, revelation into why you're still in debt, uh, or why the addictions are holding on. He's given you revelation into the, uh, the things about your relationships. He's given you revelation into destiny. This is a month, I tell you, uh, it's the month that the books of the enemy are going to now open. And uh, again, you'll see it in Jeremiah 11.3. I believe that's the verse. I've been decreeing this verse, praying this over and over, uh, that the that the enemy plans of the enemy be revealed. I tell you, it's happening right now, and 
I'm excited about uh, this. I, I've been battling for two days now because my books got opened, you know, over me personally. And I was able to take out some things that were hidden, hidden things in there about my health even. Now I've got a massive amount of healing, but I still needed to gain weight and some stuff like that. I'm the only person around looking for supernatural weight gain, I realized. But I got a strategy. I got a strategy. I got a breakthrough in this just two days ago. Uh, then today, the Lord showed me what the enemy had against me inside uh, inside some things that were kind of hidden you know, away. And that's what's going on. So watch for dreams. Watch for the plans of the enemy to come. Watch for these things to happen right now. And also, major encounters are going to start happening. And I don't know if you've been following any of my prophetic words, but this past week, I haven't even been able to keep up with what happened. And uh, I did a, a special uh, video with uh, with Todd Bentley because I was there in South Carolina just last weekend. And I talked about this, but I want to talk about this deeper side of it for a minute. And this, uh, you know, I actually didn't even know all that, that uh, was going to happen to me even after that, that um, broadcast I did with Todd. On Monday, I believe it was, even after that, I had some major encounters. In fact, one of the huge ones just happened and a global revival angel has now been released. Now, this is good news, folks. This is why I signed up, is to see global revival. And now I've been battling for years to see revival. And I, that's why I'm here in L.A., and we've just given it all. It's, you know, we've given everything we have to open this up in Los Angeles and over, over the uh, California that would impact the entire world. So I actually am positioned here in Hollywood, outside Hollywood, uh, but here in this area. And I've opened the portal of the Lord here. And it's been a battle, I tell you, it's been pretty intense. But the Lord called me to do it. And uh, it, what happened to me is two years and nine months ago, I had an encounter. I was living, I was right in this chair right here, and I had an encounter with the Lord, and I was taken uh, into heaven, and, and, and the Lord said, would you come back at 8.08? That's what he told me, because I mean, it was about 6 a.m. I, I do this all the time. Now, this was before the big encounters I started having in 2017, but at 8.08, he said, come back in heaven because there were meetings going on. Now, this was in May of 2016. Two years, nine months ago, it's a significant time, and I went into the uh, into this heavenly encounter. It was a vision, and I saw Amy Simple McPherson and Rex Humbard. Now, Amy Simple McPherson, uh, she was the last person really to reach Hollywood back in 19, uh, 1917 and through the nineteen twenties and even thirties. She started the Four Square Foundation. She had uh, Angelus Temple. She had international back then. She was international, the first radio station. She was uh, uh, had a powerful, powerful anointing. And, you know, I had that encounter uh, with her on, and Rex Humbard, by the way, who, uh, I don't want to go into the whole story. You'll hear it on my webcast. Go out, just uh, a spirit connection. I'll tell you everything about it. But basically, Rex Humbard, who was my pastor when I came to the Lord at age, uh, age 12 in Akron, Ohio, he was the first uh, minister to put TV, put church on TV. And Amy Simple McPherson was the first with radio. And the Lord spoke to me that, that just like Amy was to radio and Rex Humbard was to TV in the 50s. So you and your generation now are to the internet. We're about to see a move of God come on the internet. And anyway, uh, Amy Simple McPherson hands me in this encounter in 2016, a certificate. Look, like it, it, it was a golden certificate. I, could, I don't remember everything about what was on it, uh, but it was an assignment. And this happened in 2016. And then last weekend, when I was in, uh, in uh, Fort Mill, South Carolina with Todd Bentley, I'm telling the story. He pulls out this certificate that he was, this, it was from Amy Simple McPherson. The Lord had told him to give it to me before I even told him the story. And it was a certificate, a diploma signed by her in 1930. And this diploma was just like the one I got, I saw in heaven. So in other words, this was a physical sign on 
earth with a heavenly encounter. This is on earth as it is in heaven. It was a physical sign that what I saw happen a couple years ago is about to now happen. And every time I would go to pray, now this was a, an assignment that I was received from heaven uh, through about regarding uh, Amy Simple McPherson. I, I had way more that I don't have time to go into now. I do it on the webcast. I talk about the, the details, how finances got released. Uh, you know, when I first asked for an assignment from her back in 2006, we got a, a uh, 2005, we got a, a check from the, the Foursquare Foundation, a, a grant to do something here in Hollywood. So I'm just saying, there's something in it. I got that check uh, years ago, and then suddenly, I that was a check meeting of money in the bank, over $100,000 that came as a sign that this was coming. Then, I know I'm fast-forwarding, you got to go to my Spirit Connection webcast and catch this, because there's such a powerful anointing with what's going on right now. Then, what happened is, uh, just in the past few weeks, uh, things started to kick up again, and, and every time I would pray, for revival, I would see Amy Simple McPherson's international angel of revival chained up under chains in Hollywood. And I started to pray, uh, you know, about that. And uh, after uh, getting the, the certificate from Todd Bentley as a confirmation, I looked and the date on it was so powerful. My goodness, the date on this that she signed it was uh, uh, June 28th, I believe it was. I want to make sure I got it. I, buy the, uh, I hope I got the right. But June 28th, 1930. And the Lord said, do the math, because June 28th, 1930, if I'm quoting it right, hope I'm doing this by memory and everything's happened this week. June 28th, 1930 to March 8th, which is tomorrow, which is my birthday, is 88 years eight months and eight days. And I was having that encounter at 8.08 a.m. Eight is new beginnings. The Lord said, he's doing something new. Now my birthday's tomorrow, I turned 60, and I've had so many prophetic words uh, over it. You can go to, actually I have a, a video set up of some of them, but uh, James Gall said to me two years ago, he said, when you turn 60, the very purposes you came into the world are gonna come about. And I've been told this many times, and it's happening tomorrow. I turned 60 years old, and there was a significance of getting this birthday gift from heaven. I want to tell you, this isn't just for me. This is for you. Do you need a breakthrough in your life? God's about to do something so radically new. So I'm given the certificate, 88 years, 8 months, eight days, tomorrow is my birthday, when this all happened this week, the week of my birthday, and then I, uh, it was, I believe it was on uh, Wednesday, Tuesday or Wednesday, I can't remember, it's been such a blur, I think it was Wednesday, the Lord gave me the key to unlock Amy Simple McPherson's international Global was basically, the word international wasn't around back in 1917 to 1920. It wasn't, it was global, it is now, but it was basically her global revival angel had been locked up and, and the Lord gave me the key. And on the key, in this encounter I had on Wednesday, on that key said, Daniel 808, and I knew what it meant. And so in the encounter just this week, this is just happening day after day. I'm having more after more after more. And I'm telling you, I went and was able to take out the demonic forces that were holding back revival. Listen to this. You've got to understand that there's signs happening in heaven to prove this stuff is real. And as I did that, I... Uh, as I, I did that on Tuesday night, I think, and on Wednesday, uh, this stuff happened. I unlocked that angel. I took out the, there's two demonic forces that were standing in the way, and, and I unlocked the angel. That was the night, that very night, as signs in heaven. I'm going to show you a web page right now. Remember, I don't know if you saw it on the news, over 2,000 lightning strikes happened in Los Angeles. That night, March 6th, it was between March 5th and 6th, 
that night, this is right where I live, and here was just one picture of many, over 2,000 lightning strikes because there was a war going on and there was a heaven, you know, all I did is go unlock the angel the Lord brought in. I saw Michael the archangel come in and fight a battle that took about 24 hours. And uh, this began to happen and a sign in the heaven that I got the sign on earth is I got the certificate with the date on it, right? Then this, another sign was after our unlocking the revival, the global revival angel on Wednesday, then the heavens, uh, there was a war in heaven and that 2000 lightning strikes happened. And I'm telling you, this angel is now back in heaven and going to come back. We are about to step into a level of global revival that we have never seen. I am so thrilled because, you know, I've been sowing it here. I've been pounding away here uh, in Los Angeles. We've been giving it all. And I want you to go to my website and, and watch uh, watch the video of the Spirit Connection webcast because it's not going to be in the uh, regular prophetic word that I put out in writing. It's only going to be there uh, to watch that. And also, the Lord told me that this would happen at my birthday. And I want, to, want you to consider, like, I've been, people have been asking me what I want for my birthday. I want revival for my birthday. And so if you want to consider and you want to see the prophetic words that, that some of the people spoke over me, We've got a web page set up, dougaddison.com forward slash birthday, and you can see some of the prophetic words from uh, some of my friends there, and it'll give you the opportunity to sow into this. I'm not asking, I don't want money for my birthday. In fact, I don't want anything. I'm asking people to sow into my ministry. This does not come to me because I've asked all gifts go to this prophetic word and to go into my ministry because we have given it all. Uh, and again, it's just not going to me personally, but I, this is my request. If you wanted to sow into my birthday, to my 60th, and you'll watch the prophetic words from, uh, you know, from uh, Patricia King and some others that are there, you, you watch those words and you want to sow into what God's doing. Plus, if, if I've actually helped you in any way, my daily prophetics, then I want you to, uh, if you, the Lord leads you right now is to sow my birthday gift into revival. That's what I want. I want this morning the Lord said, Tomorrow's your birthday. What do you want? I said, I want to be released. I want, I want revival, Lord. I want to be released from this season of limitations and I want to see something happen now. And so we've set up that special page, dougaddison.com forward slash birthday. And uh, it's going to be a great, con it's just going to, I'm so excited for what. Uh, for what's going on right now and we're just gonna we're entering into a new season now I've had more encounters in the past week that I've had in a very long time so I want to release this over you dreams and visions I release the heavenly encounters the deep things of the Lord will come and the revelation that you need to break the deep things of Satan that have been coming against you, against our country, against uh, a revival. Lord, we pray right now, just as that angel got released. It went back in heaven, by the way. It's going to be back on May 5th, is what the Lord said, that on May 5th, it's gonna, there's going to be a uh, uh, something significant happen. This is all so fresh. I haven't even written it down yet. And Lord, I release this right now, this word about the assignments happening those who need something right now, then the Lord is releasing an assignment to you. The, uh, uh, the inheritances that have been set aside and, and have been uh, neglected even by other people are now going to come to you or, or those who are asking for it, just like I got it. I went into the A.B. Simple McPherson's church that she used to preach at years ago, right, that back in 1917. I went in there in, in 2005 and I, four, 2004, said, Lord, if there was anything that she couldn't fulfill, give it to us to fulfill. Within one year, we got a $125,000 grant from their foundation as a sign. Here we are late years later, I get a certificate signed through Todd Bentley. He, someone had given it to him, an old, this old intercessor later, lady had given it to him, signed 88 years, eight days, eight months and eight days later. When I'm turning 60, I'm just saying, this is so exciting. 
not for me, but for everybody because I've battled and we've given it all. And I know that you too have been battling and that you want a breakthrough. So Lord, I pray for the breakthroughs. I pray for the strategic level that we need to overcome the things that have overcome us. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, just remember to go to DougAddison.com. Check out the Spirit Connection website, uh, webcast where I talk about this revival angel that uh, you could get the whole impartation. And I, I unpacked everything I could. Uh, and uh, anyway, hope to see you soon.